everyone welcome to my channel this channel is about me and my dog we are actually from Malaysia but now we are in Geneva Switzerland do you want to know more about how I bring my dog to travel if you do please continue watching my video This is our first time going to the Alps together. The destination is Stockholm in Switzerland. It will take almost 3 hours train ride to arrive. I bring a blanket. If it is not too cold, at least he can sit on it in the train. It is our first time going to the mountain. I seriously have no idea how cold it will be. We have a red sweater and a winter jacket. It can cover up to his neck to keep him warm. Isn't he cute? Other than the blanket, sweater and the jacket, I have also got this ready for my dog. It is now 7am and here we go! Of course, breakfast is something that you cannot miss before the 3 hours train ride. We are now at Ga Konowan train station in Geneva and we are going to take the 7.45 am train to Ellen Bahn Simita. For your information, if you travel in Switzerland by train more than 2-3 to three times a year, you should get a halfway card which will cost you 185 francs and you will be able to get half price of all the train tickets in a year. Unfortunately, there is no halfway card for my dog. So I bought a day pass which costs 25 francs a day and he can sit next to me just like human. During the train ride, you can also see the Bernice Alps. After 3 hours of train ride, we have finally arrived! First things first, I need to give my dog some time to release and then we will need to walk approximately 10 minutes to get to the cable car station of Stockholm. In case you are not aware, there are three big parts of Switzerland. One is Italian influence, another one is French influence and where we are here in Stockholm is very much German influence. You can actually tell from the building architecture and the language. Hmm. For the cable car to Stockholm, the ticket is 30 francs per person and 10 francs for dog you'll be able to see the amazing view of Bernice Alps and its surrounding from the bottom to the top when you are in the cable car. Finally, we have arrived at the top. No words can describe my feeling. It is my first time got to the Alps and it's my Mia Nia's first time too. This is magnificent. This is so surreal. It looks just like a wallpaper. You might have realized by now that I have changed his clothes as the weather is not as cold as I thought. The sun is out, perfect weather at the Alps. And my Nina is definitely enjoying his short hiking with the perfect view and the weather. For your information, the altitude of Stockholm is only 2,190 meters. It is actually tolerable for dogs. Dogs will only suffer from altitude above 5,000 meters. Temperature-wise, dogs will feel cold when it is below 10 degrees Celsius. It's lunch time. We are so hungry. According to Achun, roast tea is one of the must try Swiss food. It is mainly made by onions, potatoes, and cheese. I have 
just change a sweater for my Nyingya because the wind is getting stronger. After a few hours at the mountain, we are tired and we are going back now. One advice for you guys, you always need to check the next train time so that you can still hang around at the Alps instead of spending time waiting for the train at the train station. Okay, so now you have watched my video. So please don't forget to like, subscribe or leave your comments if you like. We promise to produce more good videos.